Category 4 is going to be your permanent way for your state board. Um, as you can see, I've already sectioned it into nine sections. Uh, this is the category that you're going to be adding the chemical draping, so you're going to make sure to add your extra towel. You have 15 minutes to section it into nine sections and to wrap six rods. Your rods are going to be wrapped here in the front right section, making sure that you have a water bottle to wet the section down as you're working. The supplies that you're going to need are going to be six rods. They need to have two white, two gray, two pink. You need to have a tail comb or a styling comb. It's your preference how you prefer to section. Uh, make sure that you have at least nine clips for the hair and a tenth one for your um, draping. Your gloves, your solution, which is going to be water because it's a mock application, your perm um, cotton to wrap around the section, and your end papers to use as you are wrapping the perm. So um, you don't have to wear your gloves as you're wrapping it. You can use them, uh, do that as you are processing the perm. So we're going to take... Um, all perms get wrapped at a 90 degree elevation or half base. So make sure that you're taking your section and you are wrapping it 90 degrees from where it grows. You have to use two end papers and your section cannot be any wider than your perm rod that you're using. Some of the things that your state board examiner are going to be uh, checking for on your six rods are that you have your bands uh, not too tight to the scalp and that they're not twisted or crooked when they're laying on the perm rod. When the examiners go to check your perm, they're going to ask you to unwrap two rods that they choose to make sure that you have not fish hooked your ends or that your ends are very clean and straight like this as you wrap them around the rod. So be very cautious when you're wrapping your perm to make sure your ends stay really straight. Always check your bands to make sure they're not crooked, they're straight. When you're done wrapping your six rods, your examiner will come over and ask you to complete your perm. At that portion, you're going to wrap around the six rods. You do not have to focus on the hair that's remaining. You only have to worry about the six rods that you have used. Um, at this point, after you've wrapped the cotton around, you need to make sure to put your gloves on since you're going to be using a chemical solution. Um, also, have an extra towel with you so that you can um, catch any excess drip. When you're applying the solution, you want to make sure to have a good steady stream. You don't want to just dribble it on there, but go ahead and give some pressure. One, two, sometimes you can even do a third one if you feel like. But something that they don't want to see is ex excess dripping of the perm solution. So whenever you move away, you don't want it to be just freely flowing of chemical, but that um, chemical solution on there, and then you are done. This completes the category for the permanent wave.